Hey there, degenerates. Well, we have done our business with the Mythic Dawn Cult. And they are done. Unfortunately, we did not recover the Amulet of Kings, but we got a big shiny book that apparently we need to give to Martin. So, that is the action we are going to take today, because I can't think of anything else to do. Except it's a long way. My goodness, it's a long way. So, I guess we're warping there. Oh, and but incidentally, if you happen to hear this horrible humming sound, it's because my brilliant genius of a neighbor has decided to mow his grass in the rain at 6 o'clock in the evening. Okay, then. I love dealing with people. I also love milk thistle seeds. I'm surprised it's already replenished. I guess it's been a while. Hi. I Thank see that you're approaching you me. Safely. What now? Do you have the amulet? Jeez, pushy pushy. Nip. Please Cat tell got me you have some good news. Please tell me you're gonna stop being rude to me. Because I've got a book. Oh, good. You should take that to Martin right away. Well, I would. He'll if be I... in a great hall, read it. He's hardly taken time to sleep since you left. He doesn't need to sleep. He's immortal. He can sleep when he's... Wait, I guess... Oh, I guess that is a problem, come to think of it. Oh well. Anyway, let's take it to Martin like I intended to do before I was so rudely interrupted. Got a nice little dining hall here. Oh, and there's Martin. Right there. Unfortunately, he will get mad at me if I try to read Modern Heretics, so I guess I won't. Hey. Hail to you too. Now, can I talk to Martin? Ah, you're back. I told Jeffrey not to worry. Yeah, we've survived warrior situations. Nope, but I got this book. You can have it. By the nine, such a thing is dangerous even to handle. Oh, well, nobody Forget told me. me. You were right to bring it, but you better give it to me. I know some ways to protect myself from its evil power. Oh, really? So, what about that amulet? What about that Costco on my I lap? Don't know. Maybe. Costco. I suspect that the secret of how to open a portal to Camelot's paradise lies within these pages. I do like the sound of paradise. So I will need time. Tampering with dark secrets, even just reading them, can be very dangerous. You will have to proceed carefully. Well, you In the meantime, I'll you should speak you to Jeffrey. He's concerned about reports of spies and women. Alright, I suppose I can do that. Daedric magic. I'm I kind put of aside curious. the dark arts when I became a priest. The workings of fate may be seen in this too. Dark arts? The gods can turn anything to good. Or so I piously told those who came to see me for advice. <laughs> Except for ice spells. I may yet come to believe it myself. I spells are not turned to good. I hope to have at least part of my mysterious arts translated in a few days. Speak to John for what your spies are meant Getting good at getting orders, aren't you? What a punk. Oscar, you're gonna have to settle down. I, I'm dead serious here. Good evening, ma'am. Thank you. Although I, I, I don't like being ma'am, but I'll deal with it. Work tracking down the mythic bone secret shrine. Finally took the fight to the enemy. Yeah, you could say that. They're definitely all lying dead. I hope Martin knows what he's doing with that evil book. I fear for what it could do to him if he's not careful. It didn't seem all that evil to me. It's just a book. Anyway, down to business. I heard some... Well, actually... What about Boris? I wonder what you have to say. I'm glad to have Boris here. He oh. guards Martin night and day. His way of atoning for the death of Emperor Uriel, I suppose. Good thing I didn't let him die. Alright. Spies. Ah, yes. I hope you can help. The gate guards have reported seeing strangers on the road for the past several nights. And that's unusual I because... I cannot leave Cloud Ruler undefended while my men search the whole mountainside, but these spies must be eliminated. Just because they're walking around at night, they've got to be spies? I'll get to the bottom of this. Thank you. Talk to Stefan. He can tell you where he has seen them. Apparently you're not allowed to- in Bruma may also be able to help. I've asked the Countess to have the guard keep an eye out for strangers. Track down the spies and kill them. What? Find out what they know and what they're planning if possible. 
do we even know they're spies? All we know is there's some strangers around Bruma. I was a stranger going to Bruma. They didn't just kill me out of hand. Good thing, too. I'd have been unhappy about that. Man, I don't know about that. I'm reluctant to just randomly murder some people just because I'm told to. So, yeah, that and I'm tired of getting pushed around by a Martin. So, no. No, no, and no. Um, let's see, is there anything I can do? Hey. Now, I've been hauling around uh, bone meal for some time because of this quest right here. Oh, I've forgotten all about it. So let's go ahead and deal with Daedra. Because apparently this is an evil thing to do and I don't care. Supposedly this is- oh jeez. Bit of a long way. Happily, fast travel will save us. A trip. Tosca. You're really obnoxious. She's just sitting on my lap. Not- like sitting up so it's hard to get to the keyboard and she keeps looking at me with big green eyes. And then I try to pet her, and she's like, ah, don't pet me. Oh, hi. That would be a portal. Very, very close by. Hmm, tempting. Bone meal, mort flesh. Eh, we'll go with mort flesh, it's heavier. Why did the changes of the caffeine I brought forth? And why your offering give me the profane of interest mark? I do like profanity. The undead is unnatural things. Some of my rivals take pleasure in these abominations. Not Meridia. I wish these creatures destroyed. Hmm, that sounds pretty good. Wait, unless you want in me to. Behind a door, deep in the living cave, are necromancers. The group grieves for the materials to raise their undead armies. Find these Lord. necromancers. Destroy them and their abominations. Do this and earn the gratitude of Meridia. Well, the gratitude of Daedra is kind of a scary thing, but then again, it's questy. So let's go kill some necromancers. Sounds good to me. What about you, Arthur? I'm sure Martin would have gone right. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That's two Oblivion Gates. We're getting kind of crowded. This is not a good thing. I kind of don't want to run into that one just yet. I really don't remember that one being there before. So where are we going? Howling Cave? Howling Mine? Howling... Oh jeez, it's all the way over here. Well, we'll stop by, uh, one of the camps here. Of course, we'll need to immediately prepare for battle, because I'm sure there will be bandits. Yep, that's a bandit in my face. And that's me running away from it. And there's another oblivion, two more oblivion gates. It's going to take a while if we want to shut all these down. I'm kind of not happy about them being there, so I do desire to stop them. That's a lot. Awesome. Yeah. All right. So where's this cave at? This direction. Happily away from all Oblivion gates. Marginally. Jeez. There's lots of stuff out here. Well, I'm kind of thinking about what. Alkanet! Alkanet must have it. Sorry. I have enough that I ought to be able to start using light spells instead of this crappy little fortress. But yeah. Exploration is starting to sound pretty good. Just like flax. And more Alkanet. Flax. Okay, there we go. Even if it is a failure, then Okay, I got nothing. I don't know. Did I get that out gonna? 
No. So let us make some light potions. This is one I've not really demonstrated before because honestly I didn't think I needed to. But I did. So. Milk thistle. Oh, tell me that's not the only one. Ah, yes, the white seed. Oh, but those do water breathing too. I've got a spell for water breathing. One light. Light. Oh well. It's a start. Oh, that's right. I forgot I actually had some already. Well, never you mind. Yes, Casca, get down, for you are vastly inconvenient to me anyway. And here's Howling Cave. Not really the most comfortable of descriptions. It is not too noisy. That would be obnoxious. Okay. Well, there is an immediate rat. I'm not exactly intimidated. No, I'm gonna let Earth look handle this one. Me either. That is to say, I was not impressed. This rather looks more like a mine than a cave. Complete with silver veins! Wait a second. I don't think this is right. No, no, that's right. Appears to be right. It's not a necromancer, but it's a mud crab. And just for you, I read atheist fisticuffs. There. Are you happy? I hope so. So now they're getting put away. Holy mackerel, that's a lot of wisp stocks. Yep, that's definitely a lot of wisp stocks. So many that I do not want to take the trouble to harvest them all. Just too annoying. Seems like this place is somewhat circular, but with a secondary passage. Fine. More fisticuffs. Oh no! I've been spotted. In my fisticuffy F Wow! Leaping a rats! You pathetic worm. Jumping rodents. And Ah. Movement. There we go. Need lockpicks. I do need to know why I'm so overburdened, though. I might have something to do with it. While I'm in the vicinity, I'll stop by the house after I finish up this little assignment. Oh, jeez. Rats, rats. I was promised necromancers to go and slaughter. Not empty silver veins and rodents with the uh, acrobatic skill 100. Ah, rodents are uninteresting. Come on, seriously, it's not that hard to kill. Oh, good. More rats. No, I appreciate you not coming out. Fine. Have a DD. Or waste a DD. This place is silly. I might have to have a word or two with Meridia in the cave of non necromancers. Necromantic rats? No, I, I don't think that's what's going on here. I think you were just misinformed. Oh, that's a cave-in. I have a little bit of interest. And it looks like we have the same over here. Well done. Yep, that's definitely lots of cave-in. 
No, let's not get stuck again behind the beam. That would just be ridiculously annoying. Wait, didn't I go down there? I thought I went down there. I thought it was a dead end. Apparently I'm vastly mistaken. Look, that's a silver vein. Okay, that was a dead end. So where the heck am I going? Seriously? Because I'm getting kind of irritated here. Alright, turn immediately. There we go. That's a forward looking direction. Oh, and there's some undead. Well, that's good in a relative sense. At least we haven't entirely found the wrong place. And are wasting our time demolishing rats. Wow, I like how the Earthers Dater are doing nothing to help him. Oh, never mind. There he goes. And the ancient ghost with ectoplasm of oh, complete uselessness. You know, that's just too heavy to waste my time picking it up. Ah, perhaps this is why we were not yet seeing necromancers. And I thought that was going to be a cave in. I was mortally terrified. I don't need skulls! Seriously, get the point! Stop offering them to me. Hi, that's my face. It's a perspective we rarely see. Go ahead and charge in. Enjoy setting off the trap. And holy cow, that's a lot of... No, that's not a whole lot of necromancers. It's more than I was bargaining with. And yes, block the zombie, please. If you do nothing else, block their way to me. Because this is kind of a narrow cavern and I'm kind of intimidated. Wow, they're hurting DB. I will summon a fresh Dee Dee. Oh, thank goodness, they're going after Dee Dee. So they could very easily get me, and I don't want to be gotten. Crap. There we go. There is some definitely violent and vicious combat going on. I'm sorry that I'm staying out of the way of it, but... I'm not as sorry that I'm staying out of the way of it. That's a lot of strong potions of healing. Do I even need any? Well, for purposes of money, I will take them, but... That's a lot of equipment. For a mere necromancer. Alright, Dee, Get him. I'm sorry, Rithro. You're just gonna have to stick it out. Me and Dee are blocking your retreat. No, no, no. I don't appreciate this. Yes, everything can go after Dee Dee. That is how it should work. I'm not picking up more flesh. And checking out what this necromancer might have. Jeez. I mean, the potion amounts are getting ridiculous. I'm gonna have to either stop picking them up, which is not likely, or start processing ingredients. Or something. Definitely going to do something about it. Oh, that's right, I have a feather spell. Whatever you mind. No, you really should be fighting the ghost, Dee Dee. See? It's hurting her to her. Dee Dee, where are you? Okay. Oh, hi, skeleton out of nowhere. Um, no. No. No! That is not the preferred course of action. No! Dang it, ghost. You just don't take no for an answer very well, do you? Look. Dee Dee. Dee Dee is a big target with cl- fall. Falls and Clangs, yes. Falls and Clangs, that it's a video title for you. And if it's not, only because I like being perverse and not giving it the title after I've said I'm going to give it that title. Anyway, 
Um, the ghost is dead, again. Dee Dee is very much alive and in my way. Dee Dee, that's creepy, guys. Thank you. Thank you for despawning and not being creepy. And holy hell, I have forgotten all about the light potion. I am terribly sorry. You probably have no idea what has happened in the last 30 minutes. Actually, we're about 20. So, in the next 20 minutes, hopefully we can see what's going on. Until then, degenerates, sorry for leaving you in darkness.